Rasmus, from your point of view as a mental coach, what does it take to prepare yourself as a rider for the mental challenge of the terrain? Big question, very big question, and a good question, by the way. And, and a question most riders should be concerning themselves with, uh, if they haven't already, at least. Because uh, this is a three-day event, uh, three-day eventing, meaning that we are you know, trying to compete at our best for three days straight. And not only in the same competition, not only dress outs, not only in the terrain and the cross country and, and the show jumping, it's all of them together. So this is the, the triathlon of, of equestrian world uh, that we are seeing tomorrow and it's gonna demand the, the utmost of, of all of them. Not only the horses, which many of us tend to, to see, well, well, if my horses are in good shape, if I've done the, the work back home, if I've competed, if I have qualified, well, then I should be home free. No, definitely not. Because where focus goes, energy flows. Which means that there are so many different things that could just, you know, show up in your mind. You know, a noise, uh, a new thing in the, in the obstacle you haven't seen before. Somebody walking uh, past the, the, the fences, uh, spectators, um, you know. The weather, the, 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 the ground, everything is, is new. So uh, the, the, the challenge is to keep your focus with you and your horse at all times and what you're doing now. Not, not you know, how, how did it go in, in the dress out to, today when you're riding tomorrow. Tomorrow, it's tomorrow. And, and, and not thinking about, well, you know, I have a good show jumper, so, you know, I, I'll look forward to, to Sunday. No, it's now. So where focus goes, energy flows.